was flashing his soldier the game spitter. See, the biggest mistake LaLota made, he put all his eggs in one basket. He went to Walmart, took the whole dozen of eggs and put it into one girl. What was his eggs? His money, his potential, his fame, his music, his future kids, his family, and a whole bunch of other eggs he put into one girl. Understand, not realizing he only 20 years old, 19, 20, 21. Not understanding that's puppy love. Not understanding that even the best of them get cheated on. We cheat, they cheat. Not respecting his position in life, his blessing that he got with the talent to do music, with all the followers he had. Yeah, I understand he just gained 200 more thousand. Yeah, but he already had a good 400,000 before he even died. So he definitely was going in the right direction in a good space. He definitely got the listeners. They were listening to him. A lot of people didn't listen to him, but he had his listeners. He had a big following on YouTube. Understand? So he was doing the right thing, but that wasn't the most important thing to him. The most important thing to him was that female right there. And, yeah, even though he might can catch a body, alleged, he can sling that iron. I just said in the last video, he can sling that iron. He can, he can smoke runts, and, yeah, he can dress with the best of them and get respect from this gangster and that gangster and get respect from 30 Deep and all that dub, but... Nah, they ain't what he care about the most. They, that's just one character. But the real him is he wanted to be in love. They're probably his first love. They're probably the first. He probably loved that girl more than he loved his own mama. Yeah, he loved that girl more than he loved his own daddy, his own family, his own grandma. He put all his love in her. And she crushed him. She knew that he would have done something like that. She knew because anytime when somebody would kill himself, commit suicide, whatever, they didn't told the other partner that they'll do that. And best believe he done told her he'll kill her too. So understand, she lucky. Look, little mama, you lucky that he ain't catching the action. Because what he would have done was killed you and he would have killed old buddy. And then he probably would have took himself out. Understand that. So you lucky he ain't catching the action. Because he would have walked home. You would have yeah, brought old buddy back to the crib and he would have walked in on it. Yeah, he would have downed you. He would have ran up on y'all at a, at a in the car or to a movie theater or something, he would have downed you, both of you, right there. And probably ended his own self right then and there. So understand, you lucky. You got spared. Which, he shouldn't even took it there, as far as killing himself or even hurting you. When he could just go in his DM and there's plenty of females in there ready to throw themselves at him. Because they groupies and they're a fan of him. But he ain't want that. You could tell he ain't used to having a lot of hoes. He ain't used to having being in a lot of relationships. So, you had to be his first love to make somebody do that. And he wasn't prepared for that. He already had a lot on his mind with his friend. They saying he did that to his homeboy. He could have, he couldn't have. We don't know. So that's alleged. So that's on his mind. He thinking about that all the time. He have nightmares about that. He be having nightmares when him and his friend were chilling and they was talking about you some days and other day they was talking about other things they was into. And that same night when it happened, he had nightmares about that. Then he had nightmares about you. He already assumed that you were cheating. You know he assumed that you were cheating. He had a nightmare that he walked in and killed you and the dude. And he had a dream about killing himself. That's why he he spoke he spoke that to existence. He was dreaming about it. Then he spoke it to you. You knew what it was. But you didn't care about that. You ain't just say, you ain't want to just leave him alone and be like, nah, we, I'm done with you. You know, you had to do what you had to do, which you could do what you want to do. Like, which is weak for doing that. No higher power respect that. Buddha don't respect that. Allah, Jesus, nobody respect suicide. So that ain't, it ain't sad. It's really weak. I mean, some people, I guess righteous or females or if your family, they can say it's sad, but nah, come on, man. Somebody like you with all that status and, and your potential and your future and your career and all that and how many people's lives you could have changed and all that though and you let her decide you let her determine whether you live and stay on the streets or not like not understanding we all can get cheated on they're just a part of the game we cheat they cheat you could be chris brown you could be bill gates you could be jeff bezos you could be 50 cent you could be anybody you could be tupac yeah, you can be anybody. Kobe Bryant. We all to get cheated on. It happened to the best of us. That don't mean it's just what they do. It's just what they do. It's what we do. Especially at that age, young. 
You could be Will Smith, see what Jada did. Yeah, but Will ain't <laughs> ain't putting no gun to his head or, or taking overdosing on no drug or hanging himself. No. No, 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 no. And that's and the whole world will see that. The whole world see it. So that was probably on your mind too, like she putting it out, putting your business out to the whole world, making you look bad. You thought about that. But she should thank you though. Cause you still could have waited. And when you seen her again, it's into her and smashed her. Yeah, then downed her right there and then did it to yourself. So you spared her. You still cared about her more than she cared about you because you still let her live. You already knew what you was going to do to yourself and you still let her live. So she should bow down to you. She should pay for the funeral. That's what she should do. Yeah, she only alive because you let her breathe. You letting her breathe right now. You was going to end it anyway. I'm telling you, you, was gonna, you knew it. Like, I'm, I'm finna do it. Like, I could wait until I see her again and play it all cool and see her again because you could have just said, I'm going to give you some money or you could have baited her up and seen her again and could have, yeah, like, yeah, and made her get found in the trunk or she could have got found in the back of the woods somewhere, Ted butted her real quick and then, then, yeah, took yourself out and, yeah, and let it be all over the news or everywhere, not just say cheese and, 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 the, and the hip hop blogs. Nah, yeah, with a made CNN with a butcher her to death. Yeah, but you spared her. You still loved her. You still loved her more than yourself. And you let her live. Now she should buy down and pay for the funeral or do something. Apology or something. Yeah, because a lot of other guys, yeah, a lot of other guys, yeah, they would have gave her the business. Yeah, why why, why should I leave and you still let you leave and you still going to do the same thing? Now we all suffer. Yeah, we all going to suffer. So that's how some dudes think. They could have, but yeah, you still spared her. So that's what it is on that. Little Loda didn't understand it was two million more women in America that was available for him. That was ready to fall in love with him. He could have choose from. Some would have said no. Some would have said yes. Women outnumber us in America by two million. It was a woman out here that was going to love you way more than her. It was going to love you way more than your mama. It would have married you and everything. Bad down, did what you say, been submissive. You just had to find your queen. That was just practice. You was only 20. But ain't nobody school you on that right there. Ain't nobody school you about the love part of the game of life. They didn't school you about getting your heart broken and not and knowing how to put your heart into certain situations and knowing how to deal with people and knowing how much heart you need to put into a situation. Ain't nobody school you on that. They just school you how to bing, 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 bing. And yeah, spit a 16. They school you on that. And yeah, roll up backwoods and swishers and dutches and everything and load clips and cop back guns and everything. They taught you that and to know how to dress and stuff like that and get your head twisted up and, yeah, and throw signs up and everything. They taught you that, but they ain't teach you about the love and the relationship part. Who should we blame? Your father? Should we blame who? Your mother? Who should we blame on that? The streets? The streets don't teach you that. The, yeah, the streets don't teach you about relationship and love part. Nah, they don't teach you that because they really ain't even necessary like that. You got to learn it from either self-experience, your father, uncles, other family members. Sometimes women can give you a little bit of game. They can give you a little bit of game for their side, but not a man's side. They can give you the game for their side. So some females can teach you that. Big sister, mama. A auntie, a cousin, a lesbian friend. Lesbians will give you good game too for they side. Understand that. But you jumped in it, two feet in, both arms in, head first in your first relationship. You did that because you ain't been through the, you ain't been through three or four different relationships. Yeah, you had a girl, you had a girlfriend in middle school. Yeah, that one. Yeah, you had a girlfriend in high school. Yeah, I mean, but this one right here, yeah, she was everything. Yeah, she was everything. She was better than life itself. Loaded. She was better than life itself. At least that's what you thought. So you know what's going to happen now, Loaded. What's next? Yeah, they're going to rush a DM, threaten her, call all type of names, call out a name, and all that. They'll say, why would you do that? And know he loves you, know he had his heart all for you and all that. Yeah, they're going to do that. But you know what? After a month, two months, six months, a year, she gonna feel it by a month, two months maybe. After that, it's gonna go away. And she gonna live on. Life goes on. And they gonna forget about you. Academics say, geez, they ain't gonna post you like that no more. The fans, they're not gonna talk about you like that no more. Only your family. Only your closest homeboys. Then after five years, two years, ten years, 
eight years, seven years, they even forget sometimes. Some of them will. Because guess what, little loaded? New people die. New people die. New loved ones die. So they got to get that same type of feeling and passion for them. New rappers die for Say Cheese and the blogs and academics and all these different blog sites. Shade Room and all that duh. New actors and actresses die. R&B singers, movie stars, and yeah, more other important people that'll take your spotlight. Somebody commit suicide every day. So, yeah, after a while, they ain't gonna talk about it no more. She young too, ain't like she 40, 50. Nah, she got a whole lot of different new guys I'm coming to her life. They ain't gonna stop the next nigga from talking to her. They be like, that was on him. That was the decision he made. Y'all wasn't married, so she could cheat. She could cheat. I can't say she was wrong for cheating. I mean, because y'all weren't married. Like, that's what humans do. She attracted to different things. Maybe, little loaded, you wasn't sturdy like that. Yeah, you were sturdy as far as in that booth. And you probably can play with that like that. Maybe. But you didn't turn her on. Like, you didn't give her that man feeling. You know, outside that booth. Like, but the fans of what we see on social media ain't what she see in real life. You couldn't make her come. You didn't turn her on. You just made sure you got your nut. You didn't make her feel protected. You didn't make her feel loved. I don't know. Maybe you probably could have cheated on her first. Or maybe she fell in love. She didn't fall. She, she wasn't in love with you no more. You ain't what she wanted. She changed her mind. She got the right to do that. She, she could change her mind. That's why she ain't, y'all ain't get married. Yeah. Yeah, she changed she changed the mind. Yeah, she yeah, she attracted to something else. Yeah, she changed the mind, she attracted to something else. She ain't number 20, 21, 22. You think she gonna just stay with you forever? That's puppy love right there, man. 20. All these groupies, all these females, they're waiting for you to slide up in them raw. They all these females from state to state. You had a female in Charlotte. Well, you had a female in Atlanta and in, in, in Las Vegas. You had females in Florida, Miami. You had a female in Queens, New York, with Jamaica ass. She waiting for you to come up there and slide in a raw. She's going to suck you up like a vacuum cleaner. Spit your balls out at the end of the bed. Yeah. Tongue kiss you in your mouth. All that though. She going to do all that though, man. She waiting on you, but you ended it. You, you closed the chapter. Matter of fact, you closed the whole book. You just closed the book. You finished the last chapter, first chapter, you was born. Second chapter, your baby, you know how to talk and you know how to walk. Third chapter, yeah, you find yourself, you hit puberty and all that there, going to school. Fourth chapter, school and all that there, get your first job. Fifth chapter, you become a rapper. You close the chapter on the sixth chapter. You closed it. First love. You close the book. A female flipped the wrong page on you and you close the book. You could have get back game. You could have hit a best friend. It was a thousand different ways that you could have made her feel it and just been a player about it. It's just a mistake that you can't come back from. It's a mistake that Allah, Jesus, Buddha, and other high powers damn respect that if you believe in that. So when you, uh, the message, the last message you type and you told God let you in the kingdom, he can't. He can't, cause now nah, if you would have, you know, went out another way and you got killed or something like that, then yeah, we could talk about it. But I don't, I, 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 I don't see it. I don't see it. He, he, when you, when you wrote that, he probably knew what you was gonna do, but he didn't know that you probably gonna do that like that or that what you was meaning at the time. You see what I'm saying? But, but in life, that's what some of us humans go through. Some of us ain't built for it, can't take it, weren't prepared, got the fame too fast, blew up too fast, fell in love too fast. Yeah, so you fell in love before you can really run through a whole bunch of groupies and run through, or maybe you hit a couple of them and nah, it wasn't her. And you thought it wouldn't be another woman out here that'll love you better than her, that'll really appreciate you better than her, that can look better than her, that can cook. They can have sex better than her. They hold you down better than her. You would have caught a beer. You would have caught a gun case for beefing with one of the ones from the other side. 
she would have did the same thing. She would have cheated on you while you was in jail. She, she could have held you down for the bed. She would have probably spent all your money and cheated on you a thousand times. That's something. That's what humans do. Yeah, that's what humans do. So you would have hurt it even more if you was behind that wall. That would have hurt. Cause now you'd have been hearing so many different stories. You felt that you knew she was cheating with old buddy. Yeah, old buddy, he didn't have the status you had. He didn't have the talent you had. But females only care about that. That's what will them in. That's what pull them in. That's what you can get them in the car. That's what you can get them in the in the scat. You can get them. You can get them. You can get them pulled in with that. The fame, the cars, the jewelry. Yeah, yeah. But what make them stay is different. You didn't have what it took to make her stay. For like in her eyes, in her head, another female. The same thing you did with her. That would have worked for her, but in her eyes, you don't know. It could you could have been too emotionally. You could have not been a leader that she wanted out of a man. You couldn't really give her that tough, that rough love that she wanted. You was feeling more sad than her. The stuff you was talking, the topics that you, yeah, you saying you gonna hurt yourself, you will kill her, or, and just being weak to her in her eyes. Yeah, she ain't respect that. She was losing respect for you, and she lose her sex drive will go down. When she around you, her sex drive go down. It can start high, but it go down when she around you all day. But that other dude around the corner, nah, he, with it, the cons that you got for her, that's her pros. He got the pros. Your cons is his pros. You know what I'm saying? That's what it was. And he just don't got the status and the money and the fame. But once a female had that, they know they can get that. Like, I got you. I can get it again. I want him right now. I want a little snack. That's all it was. That's all he was. A little snack. She'll do him the same way. Till she really find herself and really want to, yeah, a little snack. Yeah, just a little snack. One of them little snacks you can get. Them little snack uh, little snack wraps. That's all he was. He just know how to hit it right and make her feel like how she want to feel. Real passionate with it. That's what that was. And your heart couldn't take that. That was too much for you. Yeah, that was that was that my take on this little loaded situation, man. Hit the like button, hit the comment section, man. Come.